Hey, if you're looking at this review, you might be interested in uh, a bright white light uh, therapy device like this one I'm holding here. Very small, very thin, and very bright. Um, first, I want to take a look at, pull it out of the box, let's see how it looks, and then talk about what it does. Okay, this is a, a, a decidedly unexciting unboxing. This guy doesn't really have a whole lot uh, of uh, pieces or material in it, so let's take it out and take a look and see what we got. All right, we have a, uh, a uh, usual drop-in card, a small user guide, so it's got about 10 pages in it. Um, a, the lamp itself with a uh, little warning that says, please touch with your finger pulp. A little bit of a mistranslation there. And a proprietary plug. So um, let's open this guy up. So the light itself is a nice little panel like this. It's got a proprietary plug with a barrel barrel adapter uh, on the manual, and on the back you've got a kickstand for putting the thing up. So when you use it, it's going to look like this. And that's okay. You can search on the web for what the Mayo Clinic has to say about seasonal affective disorder. Um, it's a it's a real di it's a really diagnosed disease in which people um, have trouble when uh, the days get shorter and the nights get longer and they just don't get as much daylight. Um, one of the ways to treat it is with a light box like this, and uh, there's no FDA approval for these kind of light boxes, so you kind of have to look for somebody with authority like Mayo Clinic to get your information about it. Now, what the Mayo Clinic says is you want to get a light box that has at least 10,000 lux. That's just a measure of light, and you want to um, have as little ultraviolet as possible. Have if it's putting an ultraviolet you got a problem because it can cause cataracts and skin problems, skin disease, like cancer. Um, the good news is these modern LED panels don't, don't get any LED, any uh, ultraviolet at all. They're completely ultraviolet free. Uh, that's because LEDs just typically create a single frequency of light. And the, ones, the people that make white LEDs are actually using three to mix uh, into white, but there's no ultraviolet component. Now this guy puts out 10,000 lux, so that's what you want. It's small, portable, easy to use. All you gotta know to do is plug the power supply into this back, and then stand it up. You can stand it up this way, you can turn, turn the stand and stand up that way. Plug the plug into the back, and then it had the weird instructions on there about uh, pulp finger, but really you're just gonna push that button there and it turns on. Um, and uh, you can uh, hold down the, that button and make it dimmer and dimmer and dimmer. Hold this button down to make it brighter and brighter and brighter and brighter. So you can see at this, at this maximum brightness, this is a really bright light. So you're getting a lot of you know, a lot of therapeutic value out of it. And uh, amazingly enough, despite the fact that it's a super bright light, you know, it's completely cool and uh, 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 doesn't even, you know, draw that much current. This is a big improvement over the light boxes of, of yore. So this guy's a good buy, um, costs less than $50. And uh, if you follow the recommendations from somebody like the Mayo Clinic and maybe even better work with a practitioner who knows how this works, I think this could be really a uh, five-star product for you. Um, you know, not only does it work like that, but I think it's it's a uh, it's it's actually attractive. You don't mind having this thing sitting on your desk, so it's a winner. Hi, I just want to let you know that uh, I am honored by Amazon to be in the Vine program, and I take it very seriously. I work really hard with my family to do reviews on these products. Um, we have a lot of fun doing it. We get to see a lot of interesting things, and what I hope more than anything is that my reviews help you make good selections for your products. If they do, that's good for you. It's good for me, and it's good for Amazon. Uh, hope you enjoyed the review.